Hi everyone, how are you doing? We welcome you all to the hands-on video impressions of the build 1432.1003. Build 1432.100 is the latest build that Microsoft has pushed to insiders in Fastry. It's a kind of uh, patched up version of the build 1432.1001 that Microsoft pushed uh, to Windows insiders just before this. So this build does not uh, bring any new features. I mean, it's quite equivalent to the same uh, build 1432.1001. It just brings some additional fixes. So obviously, Bu and uh, Microsoft has not been generous enough to list those fixes that it brings. So all we have are like our guesses that what it may have fixed. So for that reason, we'll just talk about, we'll do a bit of hands-on and this time we will do a bit of gaming. We will play a video and then we will also do multitasking and normal because uh, some of you asked us to do a bit more than what uh, I mean traditionally we do uh, while doing this hands-on video or impressions video. We will also talk a bit about installation experience. So in our case the installation experience again <laughs> it has been surprisingly good for you. Some of you it was not that good. We came to know from few of you on Twitter that uh, some of you faced some issues while uh, going for the restart etc. But in our case, we did not face any issue and it was smoother than the last build. And we got this uh, build this time on three devices and all the, I mean, in all the cases, it was good actually. Mm -hmm. So depending, I mean, depending upon the how good your network connection is, it will take somewhere from 40 minutes to let's say some one hour, 10 minutes or like 70 minutes in some cases for uh, downloading, installing and restarting and the data migration. So that's it. So installation experience has been good. <laughs> Coming to how the build behaves, as we said, we will uh, do a bit more, a bit differently. So let's do a bit of uh, gaming on this. So here we will just play a simple game and try to see how it behaves, how it is. So we just installed Temple Run for a demo purpose here. So actually in a way it, it looks quite okay. -ish. The game resume may be a bit faster, but for that reason it, it is quite good actually. I mean even when the game you have left the game while playing it, it resumes quite well. Let's see how the video play back uh, behaves on this. Because many of you have faced issues while uh, playing videos. I mean, in, in case of other builds or older builds, so let's see. So as you can see the gaming wise or video playing wise like it, it works fine actually 
so <clears throat> no crashes or no uh, hiccups so let's talk about the general navigation so since the bill uh, 14342.1001 was itself quite stable so we believe that it should be fine So as you can see the multitasking wise it was okay we saw that uh, the gaming part i mean we, we just played a bit of so because uh, we are not uh, demoing the whole gaming thing on it but while uh, doing gaming i mean it's okay so it is even resumes well and you can play it so i mean i don't think that there is much issue there are no crashes or kind of freezes or the kind of thing if we talk about multitasking uh, of other apps, maybe we can open and do a bit of browsing as well here. Just now we were like, uh, we had played a video, but then browsing the bigger sites is always like a bit challenging, so we can do that. Last time we talked about the HTML5 score. Let's see. It's happening live. So quite a respectable score, 463 out of 555. It says you are running H14. So that's good. That's correct. So as you can see the browsing part is good now coming to Cortana let's see how the Cortana opens and behaves it's still empty so I somehow I think the miss settings are uh, no missing and maybe some in next build other build brings them here and let's see the multitasking part so it opens but it takes a bit of time while uh, resuming the game Okay, and we saw uh, Cortana crashing, so <laughs> there we are. Obviously, these kind of bugs and issues obviously will be there. So somehow I think the RAM management, it still needs improvement in case of redstone builds because uh, the Cortana just crashed in front of us in while doing the multitasking. Well, let's open the browser. The browser uh, behaves quite well actually. So I think there is some I mean, need of some kind of improvement. Last time we have talked about how the apps, I mean, they don't get closed. When you swipe down to close them at times, you will think that you have closed them. But when you go back, you may encounter that uh, issue where the apps are not actually closed. Here, uh, the behavior has been fine, actually. Maybe this build uh, brought a fix for that, but we faced that issue quite many times. So that's why we mentioned it here. Let's open more apps and see. So till now, as you can see, the only issue that we faced was with some RAM management because uh, when we opened the, I mean, the game was open in the background. When you try to resume the quota, it crashed. So that's that's obviously one of the issues I think that uh, Microsoft needs to take care of.
presbyter of ram management and improvement is required there the new store it, it was also a bit buggy but now the uh, with the re recent update the check for updates button has started working but still i mean a uh, bit of small things because it's obviously redstone fast ring build so it's not that polished there are obviously need of poly need for polish may uh, in many places basically if we talk about general navigation it is all good as we just saw there is not much difficulty no crashes etc but as we said or as we just saw that when we went to the multitasking we had opened a game and when we tried to you know multitask with that game there so kotana just crashed so maybe because the ram was not sufficient or something there may be some explanation behind that and we will obviously report it so if you just ask us so general navigation is okay the settings navigation is okay multitasking uh, we can just see once so there is browser that we will open we will open kotana So now we have so many opens okay let's go for grow music so now we have this seven okay maybe let's open one more So now we have set of 8 open but there is no game in the background and it resumes fine. Okay, I think one of them is gone again. So there is some kind of issue with the bit, I mean think RAM management that some of the you know apps in the multitasking UI are getting closed themselves by themselves. okay so that's how uh, the build is working so obviously there are a bit of uh, i mean ram management issue that we could find uh, during our hands-on apart from that if you talk about the general navigation general performance it is okay i mean uh, I, I don't see many crashes or issues but apart from this one that we just saw so if you talk about use of like a daily driver etc maybe it's not a build mint for a daily driver use because it's a redstone fast ring build but again i mean uh, for a daily driver use you have to I mean, it's better to go for a release preview ring from build 10586 but if you talk about the how the build behaves or how uh, the whole thing is going on in it's in right direction microsoft is fixing the issues bugs etc uh, but we believe that uh, in due time it these things will be sorted out and uh, when it is close to the rtm which is going to be or supposed to be on the july uh, 29 it should be much better so we will keep uh, telling you about the bills and sharing our impressions with you so stay tuned for more keep watching